All right, so breaking news from the NBA, Drew Holiday was just traded to the Celtics from the Trailblazers. So first, I'm going to break down what everyone got, then I'm going to give you my grades. So Celtics got Drew Holiday, Trailblazers got Robert Williams, Malcolm Brogdon, a 2024 Warriors first-round pick, and a 2029 Celtics first-round pick. So this is what I'm saying. Um, you can tell the Celtics are trying to build the team based off of solely star power. That's where they have Drew Holiday, Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, and Porzingis, and really no death beside Derek White. Well, the Trailblazers, their team's going to look weird, but it won't look bad. Because they're going to get a really good rebounder in Robert Williams. So honestly, i got to give the Trailblazers like a B. Because they didn't really get anything they needed besides first round picks that are bad. But the players they got, like Robert Williams and Malcolm Brogdon, they didn't really need them. But they're definitely good enough. And they're definitely going to make an impact on the Trailblazers. Celtics, I got to give them a B plus. I say that because they did get a really good defensive guard, Drew Holiday, but they did have to give up really the last few depth pieces they had besides Derek White to get that. So that's it. And I don't think this makes the Celtics a kin more contender than the Bucks. Celtics, I think we'll definitely see the Celtics play the Bucks in the Eastern Conference Finals, but Dame and Giannis are just too good. And the Trailblazers... Really, they just need a small forward, unless you want to start shooting sharp at three.